play more SimCity. See you later. Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play SimCity with me, x 2 So I off camera um, getting a bit of money so that we could put down the new sewage treatment plant. And it's just about time too because I'm, I'm really running out of places to pump my sewage. And I think... I need somewhere that will, that has room for expansion slots. Right behind my commercial buildings is obviously not optimal. So I think maybe... Right here is fine. If you look at those little red squares, those red squares are your expansion slots where you can build them. I think... Anyway, so now let's, we'll demolish this one, because we don't need it anymore. And then this guy will handle everything once, once people show up for work. Shouldn't take long. Well, I hope it doesn't take long anyway. Come on, let's go. This is quickly becoming ground pollution, unfortunately. As you can see. Sure would be nice if people showed up for work. There we go. Now it'll start pumping sewage collecting sewage from everywhere and as it does that it'll actually start treating it see how it says 100% treated so this is the how much we can actually treat which means we can actually ship sewage from other cities into this city which is actually one of my goals and we've been getting complaints about garbage so we're gonna build some more garbage trucks to help with that Let's see if we can't make sure all our garbage gets picked up. It wants us to add a dump zone. Which is fine, I guess we're probably definitely within our realm of I think we're still having like a little bit of a medical problem. I don't know if this means there were 26 that were injured that needed to be treated or if that was if that's my max capacity, but I think I'm going to build another ambulance just to be sure. Unfortunately, is we need some, or fortunately, or unfortunately, I guess that depends on your perspective. So we actually need some commercial. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a little shopping district. We got lots of low wealth commercial demand. Sims are looking for places to spend their money, and that's what we're gonna do. Actually, I think I'll build residential right there as well. Keeping in mind, not zone residential right beside the factory. We'll see if that grows. Alright, so it looks like we got sewage handled. Education looks like it's going. Looks like we're covering more students than we need to. Which 
which is good. Don't quite have. Uh, we're almost to another city expansion as well. Oh, we have another city expansion. Look at that. And we need to build the department of. Not, we don't need tourism. Access we have is to water. I don't have access to roads right now or rail right now, so I think I'm gonna build depar de the Department of Public Safety. Because that will allow us to build the larger buildings, including the hospital and the police precinct. Now, what's next on our agenda? We have more industrial demand, and actually we have a lot of commercial demand. I think what I'm gonna do is I will close off this sector here and build another big commercial block along the back there. And that's all good. like these guys to grow a little bit more. Yeah, wealth. What was I looking at? <laughs> Disasters. Uh, density map. It's interesting. These people are, are looking like they're likely to move out. Not happy, not profitable. <laughs> not enough room. So my question is, what if I go like this? And then I destroy that. I wonder if that'll make a difference. I doubt it. These blocks might have been just a little bit too tight together. I don't know. Or maybe it's because of the way the terrain hugs it. That might make a little bit more sense. People are protesting high rent. What do they want? Provide more jobs, provide more housing. Ooh, I can cut taxes. I definitely can afford it. Looks like I already succeeded at providing more jobs. What I'd really like is more people. Oh. Oh, that's just us paying for uh, coal deliveries. Oh. This elementary is at max capacity. Well, would you look at that? That is something else. Alright, uh, I think we need to put down some more people. 
I'm hesitant to put them all around here. Unless, do I need to... No, these are all... Oh. Let's take a look at the streets here. Ah, okay, here we go. These guys need... to be upgraded. And actually, this avenue can get extended out for the future. And actually, I think this should have been an avenue right here, but I'm not going to change it now. What about coming off it like... Sure, why not? And actually, I should have made it the High Density Avenue, but... What you gonna do? Okay, let's get some people moved in. Still doing pretty good on city funds, actually. Earthquake. It's sort of annoying that disasters can't be turned off, but... I guess it's just something you have to deal with. fire station. That's annoying. Of course it didn't strike when uh, I had a whole bunch of money. Wow, that really destroyed a lot of things. <laughs> I have to say, as far as features go, that's not my favorite. Oops. Everything else, everything else seems fine. All right. Now, back to zoning we go. Commercial lives there. Residential lives here. burning in my city because of that stupid earthquake. Grumble, 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 grumble. Well, I will have to save some time, some money. Yeah, I know fires are blazing out of control, but I don't have the money because fire trucks are ultra expensive. Actually, you know what I can do? I just thought of this. We're going to take out a huge bond. Just get this freaking handled. And let's take a look. Garbage is good. Medicine could be better. Place. I'll place another Police car. Yeah, everything's burning down. These blocks might be a little bit too narrow. I'm not sure. 
but we'll have to see. So these guys are my garbage trucks. Alright. I know that some of you will probably be sad to see that office go, but... I need the space. Actually, where's that park that's causing me to... I'm actually gonna remove this tree row because it's causing uh, medium wealth to grow. And I don't actually have any workers to work in the medium wealth sector. Taxes a little bit, I guess. I'm not going lower than 8%, though. That's really low. Alright, let's snipe off these little problem areas. Looks like we may have finally caught up. Looks like our fire protection has finally caught up with the city. Check our services. Waste is good. Fire should improve. Health is good. Sort of. Maybe we could use more ambulances. Public safety looks pretty good. Lots of nice little apartments here. They were on, they're on their way too, actually. pretty good. There's traffic. That could be a lot worse for a city that doesn't have a railway station. We got about 24,000 sims. You might you might notice that I'm a little bit different from I'm not like my population isn't like explosively booming. Part of that is the way that SimCity works. Um, a lot of people their answer would be well oh, you just build parks and then everything grows. But what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to actually grow this demand here this guy right here and in doing so I'm like I'm I, I have something specific in mind so you don't have to get your undies in a knot if I if I'm not doing what you think I should be doing oh jeez am I low in water I am low in water This building has a very deleterious effect on residential. So I think what I'm actually going to do is just place another water tower. Even though it's the not necessarily the most efficient way of doing it. We need some more shuttles. <laughs> Alright. So it's looking pretty good. I'm happy with all the uh, medium density that we've been getting. I would really like... I would really like to increase their happiness, but I'm not sure how to do that just right now. Aside from, like, providing them with tourism and whatnot. I do have a really high demand for industry, so I'm going to build one or two more blocks of that. And hopefully... Hmm. 
gonna try this guy out. Mostly what I want to see with him is... We'll see what I want to see with this is if it'll grow into a big factory. I'm not sure that it will. Oh. I don't really want to play screw around with this too much. Right now I kind of want to get my region up and running. But it's looking pretty good for this the type of town I wanted to build. It's kind of neat, there's like a little bit of a slope going down to the beach. And we have all these, these nice apartments that have good access to the beach. Let's put a coal mine right there. <laughs> I don't particularly want to do that. This could be interesting though. An oil derrick. Electronics, tourism, gambling. that they turned on automatic disasters it really bothers me I know you can go in sandbox mode to turn it off but it's just like so frustrating to constantly be under the heel of disasters this is very fun sorry if I seem a little bit snippy about it uh, it yeah kind of annoying not at all fun opinion, but I guess it is what it is. Please. Hmm, that's interesting. Alright, well I think now that my city's burning down. So this city's doing quite well. I'm actually quite pleased with how it's going. I, I'd like the industrial to be a little bit more successful, but I'm having trouble actually keeping enough workers without with the current zones that I have. Mostly because I probably don't just don't have enough residential. Maybe I can solve that by just building more residential. Anyway, uh, I think in the next video, I'm going to start... probably the next thing to work on is getting enough education to start taking advantage of some of the resources uh, that will get be granted access to simply moving in sims is going to be great for my tourism our tourism cities but not it doesn't solve everything anyway I'm getting pretty tired because it's super late so I think I might set these three videos to encode. Oh, Jesus. Blew up my department of utilities and now my sewage isn't functioning? Well, at least get to replant it. <laughs> that, that is the, the unsung limit of that.
actually, I think what we're gonna do before I call it a night. Okay, fire. Medicine. Holy cow. A lot of people are injured from that dino attack. Apparently, this building is burning. Hmm. So, what I'm gonna do is, I think I'm gonna set up my recycling plant next, maybe? Hmm. So I'm gonna end the video here. We're at 27,000 sims. And our city's going pretty good so far. I think in the next episode, I'll probably break ground on a new city and start construction on uh, more medium wealth buildings and m like commercial. Uh, and then maybe start working towards uh, getting a tourism trap set up. I think my ultimate goal is to get the arcology going. <laughs> and so we will need to figure out how to get alloy, metal, and TV. I think maybe... Well, we'll take a look. Um, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, Please let me know how you think I'm doing, and uh, and yeah, um, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.